How's it going everybody? Welcome back and today I wanted to do a short video to showcase how to access the final boss of the Rise of Evil DLC in Last Hero of Nostalgia. Uh, so be warned there are spoilers ahead and this is a very involved uh, process because it involves you following a specific quest line within the game. Uh, so fair warning again there are spoilers ahead so you want. So you guys are going to want to follow my 100% walkthrough for this and follow the specifically the Innocence questline. Now this questline is very difficult and it's very very easy to screw up. So like I said you're going to want to follow my walkthrough guide. Now after you finish both areas of the DLC you're and beat both bosses you're going to want to come to the Statue of Heroism Mine looks different because my playthrough was different here. Um, and there are two items that we got from each of the DLC bosses. These two items here. The Twisted Virtue of Progress. Let's see, now in my playthrough, I cannot do this. And that is mainly because I did an unburdening run. So by doing that, that completely negates the Innocence questline because you're following the Reservoir of Pains quest line so yeah the you're gonna want to remember the twisted virtue of progress and the twisted virtue of tradition here at the statue of heroism now after that you're gonna want to go to a blacksmith and we need to uh, do reforge and we need the items that we remembered are gonna turn into these to hatred of the past and the future and in turn we can reforge the evil's wrath sword and the uh, evil terror uh, armor uh, so what that does then is reforge those now these, ste these steps here uh, beyond this I am not sure of because I was not able to perform but once you do that uh, the next step is to go and talk to the old man at the heart flow altar now like I said these steps I am not sure of um, if if this the events that occur once you talk to him i have no idea of i haven't done this myself uh i am currently doing a playthrough on ps5 to test the performance and trying to go through the dlc again and do these events and access the final boss uh i'm not sure if you you access the final boss like at that point or if it's i would imagine it's later later in the game like almost around the time where you know you're almost ending the game and you're gonna fight um the reservoir of pain uh, because well i'm gonna let the events play out for you guys uh so you guys know um i know who the who it ends up being uh the uh the final boss of the dlc and i won't spoil anything i'll let you guys experience that for yourself but all i will say is that i called it in the third episode of the uh the let's play dlc uh so but uh like i said i will do another i will do another video on this um when i actually experience it myself uh and what the exact steps are uh to take uh like i said i am i am not sure because i have not experienced it myself but in any at any rate i enjoyed the dlc very very much um i thought this boss fight right here the luvani's anger was was very very good and um the eve boss fight was rather rather annoying uh i did enjoy the minecraft area uh but the boss fight uh was probably the weaker of the two so so hopefully this helps you guys uh access the uh, the final boss of the dlc let me know in the comments um you know if you if you were successful at this uh, so hopefully you are all doing well. Stay tuned. More coming at you. Take care.